Wow. I am playing against Limon Aronian. So let's play. <laughs> what can I say? Let's play. Let's go next to me here. It's one person who I never played before. It's first time I'm playing against him. Bishop d3 next. Ninety seven. Hmm. I can play g4, then h4, or bishop d3 just. Let's go bishop d3. Yeah, I want to take, but now I see it's nice c4. He will take. I can. Oh, bishop g6. I still move, of course. It's possible. Um, let's go. Castle. C5. So what now? I can take then take and d4, d4, knight e2, f4, or I can start with e4, he will take on d4, I'll take bishop d4, knight c6 then, not great. I don't know. Mm. After ninety two, he can play five, f four, f six. No, f six doesn't work. Castle and just f uh, no. Okay, let me try it. Oh. Wait a second. He could take on d4. Oh, stop. What I am doing? He just... Yeah, I didn't see it. He could take... Of course. I completely forget about this move. Um, let me take this my bishop. I'm too slow. Queen h4 is possibility here. Okay, bishop h5. Interesting move. Let's go rook d3. f5 for bishop f3. King e7 he will play. Then I d5 check, interesting move. After takes, I'm gonna take. Does it work, knight d5? 
He's gonna take me too. It would be double attack. Or I blunder something. No, I'm not blundering. Check. Let me check. Well, it looks great. Just knight d5 checks. It looks amazing. So now he have to back. If he will take, I just take. Bishop f2, it's bad for him. I just take. So he have to go back. Then knight f4. So knight d5, he blundered. Trust me. <laughs> um, Of course, maybe I'm not... Really better. Wait. Wait a second. Knight f4, bishop g6, I'm taking and taking b7. Wait. I have to go there because I'm protecting square. Now I can take and take on b7? Wait. Let's take. I can take. He cannot take because rook d8. But then he can play king e7. In the seven, I don't like. Rook h4, he gonna move. Hmm. Bishop b7, king e7, bishop a6, rook b2. Bishop b7, king e7, rook b3. A5, G3, for example. I can play Rook D7 right now, but then B5. Still not easy. If I can take Pawn, why I don't want to take? Just take Pawn. So, if I'm not blunt or something, I don't see. If he will take, I just check and takes Rock, so... King is 7, then rook b3. Let's protect my bishop. Rook d8 is gonna take, so he will play a5 then. I'm gonna play rook b5, for example. Bishop d6, just g3. And of course, why is better here? Pawns up. But not too easy. Prove it. Rook h4 is possible here. A5, rook b5, bishop d6, g3, <gasps> rook h5 then. Wait, why he do this? I can take pawn. Let's go bishop c4. I can check and bishop c4. He just give me one more pawn. check or idea is rook d2 here I don't have to protect my pawn on a2 I just can block his rock here and move then g3 Bishop c4, rook d2. He will have huge activities if I will do this. I don't like when people have activities. So, bishop c4. Go oh, bishop d3. Just block it. And g3. B4 next, and B5. Rook D4 is possible, then Rook E1, or King G2 first. 
I'm gonna play e5. Wait. Not too easy. Let's go rook b1. Idea is before. <coughs> Don't forget about counterattack. E5, e4. So I have to take. I can play c3 here or king f1. Let's go king f1. King to e2. We're gonna play f5. I can play bishop c4 and then c3. Let's go f3 here. Before Bishop b6 and then f3. Rook c7, king d3. f5, king d3, then rook e1. I'm gonna move rook e8 and attack my pawn h. So, what can I do? King d3, then rook b2, bishop h1, g1, I mean. Uh, or king d3 and rook h1. Let's go king d3. I like king d3. Oh no 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 no! Ay, ay, ay. Or what? Wait, check. Let's go there. What if I play rook g two? It will be draw or not? For example, rook h2 and g4. So I have two pawns. Ah, something. I made something wrong. Gonna play bishop c8. Yeah. Oh. B5, B6, King D4, then B6. Wait a second. After King E4, just C5. He will take. I just play B5. Fg doesn't matter. Just B6. G2, check and takes. On G2. Oh, still have chances for win. I can't say it's a huge one, but 
It's a chances. Can the force if I what he can do more? No, he's never take because it just takes. Um King F4 or Bishop F2? Bishop F2 I have to play C5. Then King C4 and push pawns. C5. He will take b5. He will go there, for example. Then I just can c4 or it takes. Probably can c4. Can c4 f4 probably losing after check. Because if I takes no, I have to play can c4. Then b6. He will go there, just check and block pawn on g2. Bishop g3, just c6, c7. Game over. So I'm gonna move just c6, c7. This is an interesting option. After g3, just check and not bishop g2, bishop h1. g2, I just gonna take bishop g3, c6, c7. I think it's a win. It has to be winning. King e5, he cannot go because I just moved b7. Bishop a5, king b5. Then again, c6, c7. And bishop b7 check and c8, queen. It has to be win. Bishop h1. Now bishop g2 I can move. Just block. King b5 and c6, c7. Yes! I won! I won to live on Aronian. Oh! Wow! Wow, not bad! What a game, what can I say? That was amazing endgame. I don't know, did I have winning position after um, trade the rocks? Probably it's not a winning, but I am of course happy. Three. No, it's a draw, but it's difficult to protect because I'm just pushing my pawns. Yeah, that's win. If you play b7, he just play g2 and then promote to queen. So it's why I moved there. King e3 is possible here, but then, for example, bishop h1 and b7. It's game over. Or c6, c7, so no choices. 
Yeah, it's amazing. End games. Wow. All right. So, yeah. <laughs> so we still can do something. <laughs> we still can can beat the guys like level like Aronian and Caruana. And don't forget, we play rapid. It's not a blitz. It's rapid. Ten minutes. <laughs> 